joining us today. Sorry, uh, we are all in masks because we've got some guests in the show. Sorry. Oh, sorry for any feedback. We've got phones running in the background. <laughs> welcome and welcome to our product showcase for the, the it's our first grand cube product showcase on a Saturday. We've never done any Facebook Live on a Saturday. Just one guys. Yeah. Wondering how it's like uh I mean how many people will be joining us today and uh hi thank you. If this is the first time you are joining us, thank you for joining us. We are both on baby slings and carriers and baby gates and safety and the product showcase basically is our way of saying thank you some people can't come to the showroom and uh people want to buy online but they want to find out about products what's the best way to do it instead of coming here it's very inconvenient for you to travel right now we bring the showroom to you so today we've got a couple of things up on the product showcase and uh, we are actually having a sale right now, the Latitude sale every year we have it in October. And um, guess what? This time it's not just in the physical showroom, it's also online as well. So you get 10% off almost everything except very uh, selected brands um, on baby slings, uh, baby, more like baby gates and safety. Uh, we have some... We have 10% off everything that's not on special promotion. Otherwise, you actually can see a lot of promotions going on. Some going for what? As little as what? Carriers? Ninety more than hundred dollars yeah. off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Less than uh more than fifty percent off yeah. actually. So best time to grab them. And uh today we are going to showcase a very special carrier that we both like a lot the Manduka first and if you look at some of the designs they are going for very special prices and uh, we have also a lot of people grabbing the uh, laundry detergents they are all on special discount we've been selling a lot I guess because uh, the rocking green detergents are really really very good 100% uh, plant-based and biodegradable good for washing not just the carriers but as the baby clothes and also if you've watched Michelle on uh, and Charlene on a product showcase on the th on Thursday you can actually see how clean the a girl's shoes became after she soaked it for like 10 minutes couldn't do it for longer but then if you get them you can actually soak it at home and then you can tell us the results okay uh so if in case you miss any of the product showcases you can just go back if you go to our website baby slings and carriers or baby gates and safety you should be able to see the banner gratitude uh, 2020 you can click on that you should be able to go back to our product lineup and you can uh, do a catch up of the previous product showcases and without further ado we'll get Michelle to show you the Manduka first feel free to ask us any questions during the show sorry we can't we may not be able to reply the IG one right if, yeah. if you're on Facebook yeah no, just DM us on Instagram yes. and I'll reply you after the live all right so good morning again everyone, I'm Michelle and I'm here today to introduce to you the Manduka First Baby Carrier. Alright, how I got introduced to this carrier first, even before I ever started um, being the baby things and carrier is that my friend was like, I think you need a carrier because you're all alone with the baby and um, you need something to carry the baby. I said, okay fine, just recommend me anything. That's how most of the parents start here, right? So. But I was lucky I got the Manduka first and because I have a super picky body, I can only fit into the Manduka, unfortunately so. Sop sops, but okay, never mind. It fit really well and it served me well for the past five years. So today we're going to talk more about the features of the Manduka first. If you know and have seen our website or actually have ever Googled about the Manduka first, there are two types of Manduka first. We have Manduka first hand cotton version which is a blend of uh, materials, obviously. It's partly hemp, which is kind of linen-like blend with organic cotton. And then you have the pure cotton version, which is fully 100% organic cotton. All right, I will tell you, before I introduce you how you roughly use the Manduka first, I will tell you the, the few differences that are between a hemp cotton carrier and a pure cotton carrier. Just give me a second. All right, do so you see these two carriers? The red one and this sandy colored one. This is the pure cotton, and this is the hand cotton version. 
All right, features wise, other than the material, they're actually exactly the same. I'm just going to close up to the camera. Can you see? This seems slightly, slightly more, uh, thicker. And uh, some parents really prefer this because if they, let's say, they have um, chunkier, heavier babies, this may offer slightly more um, support uh, in terms of weight distribution to them. Okay. Oh, shine the light. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <I'm not sure. laughs> okay. So, um, really depends on your preference, actually. And then this is the hand cotton, which Pauline would like to shine the light upon oh, the hand cotton carrier. <laughs> but, well, okay. if you want to see how lightweight it is, can you see? Look, it's very light. It's very thin. Uh, can you guys see? Yeah, can you okay. Okay. Yeah, it shines through. This is hand so cotton. It's very lightweight and airy. Yes. So you have one, if you want a slightly a lighter weight, slightly airier version of the Manduka first, you could always go for the hemp cotton. But again, it's, it boils down to your personal preference, of course. So if you like to check out the carries, you can always come down to our showroom and give them a feel. Or if not, you could always, uh, you know, check them out on our website. All right. Okay. So those are the difference, differences between the pure cotton and the hand cotton Maduka First carrier. So now I'm going to go over the features. All right, it has perfect fit adjusters at the front, which helps you adjust this neck area. Either it comes closer or if you release the buckle, it will go looser, uh, depending on what you prefer for the settings. It also has an adjustable panel height. It has two different heights. So this is the shorter setting. You can see the little zipper at the front that goes across the panel width. So when I unzip it, hold up, it's over here. When I unzip it, it gets really tall. So the Manduka first uh, is suitable from newborn onwards all the way up to about two years old. If you would like to use this carrier beyond two years old, it's definitely possible. All you have to do is add in a little accessory, which is called the Manduka seat extender, which is perfect to actually accommodate for longer tie uh, legs. And then you can use this carrier for, uh, for more years to come for it's not just two years old but beyond maybe even three or four years old all right i'm going to zip this right back up just a minute so if you would like to give all the children a little bit more freedom you can just sit down the panel height and you can actually stick their armpits over the edge of the panel and then they get a lot of upper body freedom actually of course the Mendoza first also comes in the sleeping hood which is inside here it's fixated. It's fixed down in a little handy little pocket at the edge of the panel. All right. So all you have to do is undo the Velcro and pop out the sleeping hood. So sleeping hood is present now. Okay. Just because it's hidden doesn't mean it's not there. Okay. So we're moving on to the next part of the carrier, which is the buckle. All right. If you are not already known this, Manduka is actually a, a brand of German origin. So Germans are always very safety conscious. That's why all our safety products are mostly from Germany as well. All right, but as you can see, this buckle is quite special. Majority of carriers will not have this kind of three point buckle system. All right, so how this works is you have to press and release the third button. There we go, just like that. And so it's super sturdy and it's a super safe buckle. It's a three-point buckle, so I'm going to undo it. And now, why do we say that this carrier is actually suitable for newborn? Moving on to the next uh, feature of the carrier. Can you see this little, like, little piece of cloth over here that's stuck below the elastic bands? This is actually the inbuilt infant seat. So you can start using this carrier from about 3.5 kilos onwards. All right, so there's a little pouch. I'm going to show you later how it's uh, roughly being used, okay, but I can't actually sit down, so. I'm going to wear the carrier. I'm going to show you guys how it's done with the baby. So with the manduka and most of the carriers, you always start with the belt behind you, go to the front, okay, buckle this on. Okay, first thing first, make sure that the buckle always sits on the padded area over here. Now I'm going to put the carrier slightly higher because I'm going to carry a newborn and we would like the head to be at kissing height. Okay, bring it to the front. Ooh, my buttons. Be careful. Precious dress. <laughs> I don't have that many dresses. Can I see? No, cannot see. 
是这样子。<laughs> I lost my baby. Okay, so this is the newborn. Not sure if I sit down. Okay, no, cannot see me. So I'll just, I'll just stand because uh, could you take away the. Whoa, you have fifty-one different combinations of. Oh yes, we do. We have many different combinations of the number first available. So, Malin is going to. I'm going to her table. <laughs> She's my table. <laughs> So first thing first, lab, we're going to, this is not how you carry baby, I don't mind me. But uh, first thing first, we unzip the panel height. Because we are using the inbuilt in infancy, we're actually going to, if you look properly, right, we're actually compensating a little bit of the panel height. So we have to unzip it before we put the baby in. So just, sorry, oh, here, yeah. <laughs> if you're, if you can't catch what I do now, just go to our YouTube channel and we'll show you how it's done. All right, so basically you just lie the infant down. All right, depending on the size of the infant, it depends on which buttons you button. But if you want to know in more details, go to our YouTube channel and search for our company name, Baby Slings and Carries. I'm just going to do, uh, Baby Slings and Carries. So I'm just going to do a quick one right now just to show you what it probably looks like. Yeah, can I get the button? Oh, so this is what it looks like. Right, it's like a little pouch. So baby goes up, you wear the carrier, buckle up, and a newborn inside. Newborn quite likely the legs will be inside, so that's perfectly normal. If you're slightly taller with the legs, the legs might be outside. Okay? But any other normal cases, I'm gonna take a slightly bigger baby. Okay. You won't need this in the seats. Oh, you're so this is a bigger baby, so I'm going to show you how the baby is put inside. Spread the legs gently, bring the panel up. Shoulder straps up. And two hands to the back. Can I reach? I'm not flexible either. Oh dear. Great. And then we just buckle up the behind. Chest strap. There we go, that's it. Okay. So, chunkier babies or babies with slightly heavier bum, Maduka first is actually, it gives a lot of uh, seat allowance because it has a very nice seat depth actually. Okay. So, you can see it's a very nice fit. The back and the front. And so, this is how the Maduka first is being used. So, guys, if you want this, some of the designs are actually going for about a hundred dollars off on our website. Normal price, it, oh, oh, sorry. Normal price is, normal price uh, is uh, one hand cotton. Yes, that's why the cotton is not going for ninety nine. The hand cotton version now, uh, normal price like Pauline said was one nine nine ninety. Now only going for ninety nine ninety. Only two weeks. Oh, All right, two weeks. Does it left one week only? Oh, left one week. Left one week only, right? Yeah. Left better one week only. Quickly. <laughs> Okay, this is our end of the No, it's a week until next year, but then next year, baby, big. Yeah. Okay, next year, we also don't know whether we can see our discount. Okay, so for some of the limited editions uh, and vintage editions, if you want some fancier designs, you can go for those too. Those are also a um, discount, uh, 10%, right, for the tiny ones. And then for the pure cotton, they, are, they also go for about more than about 20% off. So. Wrap them now if you can. It's an infant and it can go all the way up to toddlerhood kind of a carrier. Okay, so I'm gonna undo it. And because next up, I would like to introduce our very cute and little colleague, which is Kilia, and she'll be doing a different yeah. segment today. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! So for those people, for the brain today. Yeah, so for. <laughs> Those people who don't want to use, use this, infant. Okay, sorry, yeah, sorry here. In a minute, <laughs> forgot to introduce you guys to this accessory, which is the Manduka Size It. So if you do not wish to use the inbuilt infant seat, just use the Size It, pull it through the elastics, and size down the seat just like that. Okay, it's super easy to use. So you can just, instead of putting the baby inside the infant seat, just pop it into the seat directly by putting the size it right here. Okay, as easy as it is. One, two, three. 
There you go. Now we can have Kilia. <laughs> See you later, guys. Hi. Hi. Hi, everyone. Hi, everyone. Celia and hello again. Obviously. Obviously. Okay. We are waiting while while the light is being adjusted for her height. Okay, mm -hmm. I'm that short too. <laughs> okay, Kilia is going to show you uh, two different items today. Uh, if, if you are a parent and looking for items, uh, outdoor items, and you're wondering about safety when you are in the great outdoors, there are certain things that you need to take note of when you're bringing your child who's a little bit older, maybe toddlers, or not even toddlers, maybe about six months old onwards, where that's when people babies become more active, right? And you bring babies out a lot more in the outdoors. These days, because of the COVID situation, I think a lot of people are finding it a hassle to go to the shopping malls. If you are like me, raise your hand. I am okay. I, I sometimes try to avoid malls because there are so many places that you need to do safe entry and then it's a little bit inconvenient because sometimes the queues start to the the crowds are in the queues and I try to avoid those places if possible. And uh, we, yeah, some of our clients have told us that they prefer to hang out in the great outdoors a little bit more. So being in Singapore, it's always hot year round and the sun is always bright. And we always, uh, well, not everyone, but I wish more people would uh, understand about UV protection. And UV protection is very, very important for younger kids simply because the eyes and the skin are still very uh, at a newborn stage and not very developed yet, not ready to actually meet so much of the UV rays. So basically, you do have to keep your child well protected by uh, the either you use a sunscreen, but there are also other products that you can use easily. Some people like me, lazy to step on sunscreen for a short period of time. It's important if you want to go for longer periods of time outside. I think sunscreen is important. But other than that, for kids who are moving around already, there are a couple of things you can take note of. Get a good pair of sunglasses and Kilia is going to show us how to use, uh, she's going to talk a little bit about the baby eaters. Sunglasses like this. All right. And kid size. From they say newborn, but I believe we start using from about six months old because younger, younger babies they are so tiny. We don't really bring them up in the sun. You should try to avoid the sun as much as possible for really young babies. All right. So typically, when uh they begin to start moving around, we go out, and that's what you do. Show your. And my baby ate the sunglasses. I choose white. Okay, choose white. This is how you wear them. Okay, this baby the sunglasses, they actually come with plastics at the side and uh, shadowproof glass. And what's interesting is that the baby the sunglasses, uh, usually you you know, kids misplace things and so on and so forth, right? Uh, the baby has the sunglasses, they actually have a warranty period, uh, a guarantee, a one-year guarantee. So when you buy from us, make sure that you get the uh, receipt. You can actually go to Baby Eater's website. So for those of you who have just gotten yours, please remember you can actually register on the website babyators.com and you get a one-year warranty guarantee, which means to say if you mis misplace the sunglasses or if you have it scratched or it breaks within one year, you actually get a free replacement. You just pay for the shipping. So it looks at how, how nice it looks like this. They come in both the navigator as well as the aviator shapes. And um, nowadays they also have the keyhole, which we all have at baby slings and carriers, as well as baby gates and safety. 
So they also have the polarized version. She, <laughs> Kilia is yawning, not in our sleep. Okay, she has the polarized version. So what does the polarized version mean? Polarized means that uh, when they are looking at things outside in the sun, it doesn't reflect light. So they can see a little bit better. The polarized versions um, are, are, are so-called premium. So premium ones, uh, the one that she's holding, Kilia, would you like to show? It comes with a casing. And so it looks like the sky. It's very interesting. You get a hook there as well. You can cook on the uh, any bags that they are picking. And this one costs seventy dollars. Okay, comes in boxes like this, and in the various different colors. You can check out the uh, colors on our website. They're all going for ten percent off right now. The uh, most affordable ones would be thirty six dollars onwards. Baby Aethers also have swim goggles if you want. I think we are currently sold out. I'm so sorry. I hope that uh, we can get them back on again. But they start from $36 onwards to $70. We have sizes from about six months onwards to older kids, uh, even up to seven to even 12. So uh, check them out. They are on 10% right now. So this is one item that you should definitely get because the kids' uh, eyes are not developed yet. It'll be useful to have them wear the sunglasses when they are out in the sun. It's actually very, very useful to cut out the glass, okay? Sorry, just let me just do something here. Okay, uh, that will be for the sunglasses. And uh, now, we, apart from sunglasses, what can you use for kids when you're outdoors, especially in Singapore, Southeast Asia is really very close to the equator. UV exposure is a big thing. I, UV, too much UV exposure actually causes, is a direct cause of skin cancer. So it's something you might want to take note of and the kids get burnt. The other thing that uh, you can consider are actually sun hats. Kilia, would you like to show it sun hats? Awesome. It's from Sunday. Mm -hmm. And these are all my hats, okay? I have a lot. Mm -hmm. I have a lot of hats. Yeah. Okay, where is the shoe? You can see. This is the new one. Okay, huh? Where is the Okay. It's sort of matching, but not really matching. Kilia, would you like to talk about your hats? Yeah. Oh, she's bending it up. If you realize, this part is uh, bendable. And this is the Sunday afternoon's hats. They are good for blocking, uh, they are UPF 50 hats, so they block over 98% of the sun UV rays, UVA as well as UVB. Very, very cool in many, many different colors. And if you look at the design, it's a very smart design. It's a smart casual kind of hat. We've got black darker colors for uh, men, uh, boys, and as well as girl colors. And interesting thing is that for this cap itself, you can see, you can actually fold it very small. It's a scallop uh, brim in front. So basically, if you fold it this small, you can actually tuck it into your pocket. Very, very useful, okay? What's so good about Sunday afternoon hats is that um, we, we actually have a lot of clients uh, who like Sunday afternoon hats so much. If they lose it or they outgrow it, the kids outgrow it, they do come back to purchase them. Uh, well, simply because it really works. You can wash it. It's machine washable or you just hand wash. That's what we like to do. And for this particular one, it's actually called the, what is it called, this cap? It's a triple cap, okay? And you can see the inside. Celia, would you like to show the inside? The inside, okay, there's a small little Velcro. Whether it's an adult's hat, we have sizes for adults as well as kids. And you can put money in when you go jogging. And it protects you from the sun, okay? How fabulous, right? It protects the money too. She says it protects the money. Not that she brings any money out, but it's very useful. You don't have to uh, bring so many things out. Put a little bit of money inside. You can go jogging and uh, it's simple to bring around. If you don't need it when you're traveling, you can actually keep it 
store it away in your pocket. It comes with a cord at the back like this for the adults version so that you can make it smaller. If your head, head is a bit smaller, you go for the smaller sizes. We have the adult medium and adult large sizes. Yeah. And uh, that's for the adults head. The kids heads also come is uh, small and medium, is it? Or small and I can't remember. Medium and large sizes. So basically for the heads, uh, we have both the kids version as well as the adults version. So mom and dad and child can actually have similar heads. Okay, they are actually quite uh, I would say unisex design. So the child sizes so size will start from two years old, and then the child large size would be from about uh five years old. I think it used to call it youth. You will see that there are vents here that keeps it cool for the head as well. All right. This will be the triple text from Sunday afternoons. Sunday afternoons also, they are US brand. They also have many different designs. Those that you saw would be uh, the smaller one, which is the casual ones. This would be more for adventure. Kilius will show you. I'm going to show you this. It has two colors, one on the outside and one in the inside. So if you want to make this thing on your face, which I don't know how to do that, um, then you just take, you see this velcro down here? Take it out. Then after that, pull the string out. Then same for the other side. Just pull it out. Then you see each side has this. See this whole thing? This side also got up. It's just that. If you want to change pink or you want to change blue, if you, if you want to change We may want to step just, back so that people can see, okay. all right? If you just want to do pink, then you just take up. Not in the flesh. So the one that she's show, showing you right now is actually a clear quick pony. Maybe I can bring one more to show you how it looks like. And for the other side. So we have two colors for this. Uh, the, the other color is so at the moment. So basically, she's showing you how she takes out the cord and puts it onto the other side so you can use the reverse side as well. They are reversible. So one hat, two looks even for kids, yeah? We have the adults versions as well. Okay? See? Yeah! Outside. Inside is pink, outside is blue. How much are they going for? This is 49 dollars before discount and on 10% off right now. The triple catch for $44.90 before this. $49.90 before discount as well, I think. 10% off yeah. right now. This is my last set. I'm going to show you for today. And now... The one that she's holding on right now is actually our most popular hat for kids if we are going out on an adventure in the forest, you know, if you are going to have outing, it's going to be very hot. Why? Because these are the ones with the wider brims that actually covers all the way down to the neck. If she puts it on, you can see that it covers all the way even at the back. Some people call it the Japanese hat. So it covers all the way and protects the neck as well from the UV rays, okay? And you see here. This is not reversible, yeah? Yeah, but this side, you can clip on. They'll go on. Yes, we also have the uh, adult versions for this as well. So they are called adventure hats. The uh, adult ones are actually really popular with our clients who actually do golf. And yep, uh, very good, suitable for outdoor sports as well. Some do. Okay like kayaking and stuff and that's when you get a lot of the sun rays, right? Oh. Uh, it's very popular with the kayakers, yes? All oh, of the hats have this, so adjustable. So if your, your face is this small, 
for my face is not. <laughs> you can, if your face is bigger, you just take this thing lift up. Okay, so you can adjust it so that it fits nicely around the uh, neck under your chin, okay? And what's special about the Sunday afternoon hats is that for the kids' hat, they actually have a smart strap which breaks away is to prevent choking hazard, all right? So that uh, the Sunday afternoon hats is something that we live by. We actually get have a lot of them, adults as well as the kids. I mean, personally, the stores we have actually quite a few designs as well. So check out our website. It's on sale right now during the Gladitude sale, 10% off until 1st of November, okay? So next up, thank you very much, Peter, for showing us uh, the awesome production stuff. Okay, next we have up the strollers. Okay, so today our show product showcase will be for Manduka first, which Michelle has shown. So if you are joining us for the first time today, thank you very much for joining us. And sorry if you are seeing that the cameras are tilting here and there, you can't see me at all because uh, it's down, it's too low, I can't see anything. The Instagram can't see anything. That was a panic, wasn't that? Drop. Hello, sorry, phone dropped. Technical fault. Someone wants to hold the ring light. Okay. Can, you, can you see yourself already? IG? Uh, I, I can, but then I don't really need to do So when we are moving, we are moving the, the phone to so the light because it will flop over. We've got a new ring light, so it's a bit big and heavy, so it flops over. Uh, okay. We're still trying to get the hang of it. Hi, hi, thank you for joining us. If you just join us, thank you again. So our product showcase is on every day except Monday, Wednesday, and Sunday. And uh, if you miss any of our product showcases, you can actually go to our website, Gratitude Sale Banner. You click on it, you should be able to see previous versions. Uh, previous product showcases in the last couple of days, just to have an idea of items that you may have seen and you want to find out more. So today's product showcase, Michelle has already shown us the Manduka first earlier. And then Kilia has uh, explained to us how we use the Sunday afternoon hats, what kind of hats we have. We have the baby sunglasses as well. And now I'm doing I'm Pauline here. We're doing the mountain buggy. Okay, I'm not really a stroller mom. I used to have a couple of strollers with my older kids and they didn't work. But uh, later on, I realized that light carriers, uh, we also need to choose the correct one that fits our lifestyle. And uh, a lot of them are very heavy. So I, if you are if you are pregnant, you are watching this show. Please remember to go and check it out. How heavy it is when you fall. How how heavy it is when you carry out of your car. Can you manage by yourself? That's one thing. The smaller ones, you will need to check whether it's comfortable for you when there's a weight to push. So that's important for the mountain buggy. For for the mountain buggy as uh, a stroller that we carry uh, right now. So we, we find it very man, uh, the maneuverability. Okay, sorry for my English very bad because I'm trying to figure out who's talking out on the set here right now. Yeah, and uh, things are moving a bit. And, uh, I think the screen you can't see very well. So basically for the mountain buggy, we carry the Nano as well as the Nano Duo. They are very easy and very travel friendly. So what do I mean by this is firstly is uh, you, it's easy to maneuver, it's narrow enough so it doesn't get caught in anywhere and it's lightweight and easy to store away. Kilia is 20 over 23 kilos, actually by right the maximum weight, uh, recommended weight is I think 20 kilos if I'm not wrong for this. Donnie, how, what is the recommended? Mm -hmm. I got the weight, I'm still sitting. She says she's overweight. Okay, she's about 23 kilos and you will realize that I'm moving this around. It's very easy to maneuver. That's the nano. Okay, would you like to do it? No, because... 
I know what I mean. I can't Can you guys see? Donny says, uh, you guys can't see, so I've got to move myself a bit. All right. So this is the nano, okay? It's a single stroller. The maximum weight for this recommended weight is We've got a couple of colors going, uh, we've got a couple of colors for the sale, okay? Red being one of them. Okay, it's about 20 kilograms for the recommended weight limit. Here is 23 kilograms and it's very easy to remove. 20 kilograms. Okay, they, uh, they have just confirmed it's 20 kilograms. So basically, this one is uh, even at 23 kilograms, a lot of strollers you'll find that it's very difficult to maneuver and it's very easy and for me to push right now. I wish I had something like this, then I might find it easier to bring two kids around because they were of about the same age and it was very difficult for me to move about. Okay, and either because the stroller is too heavy and I cannot uh, carry both. I, I was alone very much when I had my first two kids and uh, yeah, I had to carry one and then the other one, I don't know what to do with them. <laughs> and the strollers being too heavy means that you cannot manage alone outside. It would have been much, much easier if it was something lighter weight so that when the child doesn't want to sit on it, you can actually carry it quite easily. Okay, Hila, can you get off? Thank you. Okay, let me show you how easy it is to keep. Apart from it being easy to maneuver, I think it's important to be able to keep it quite easily. <clears throat> most women struggle, most mummies actually struggle with this uh, tipping of the, the shoulders. And with the nano, it's actually quite easy. You, you press two buttons right here, okay, at the side, inside. And then all we need to do is to pull it together, press it down, and there we go. There's a small little catch up here. You can see that I'm carrying now. Because it's very lightweight, I can just take it off. There's a small little catch here. You catch it on, and there's also a small little um, Velcro that you can Velcro on. And a strap for you to carry. It's actually quite lightweight. I think it's only about four five, ki five kilograms. Five. 5.9 kilograms and 5.9 kilograms I think most moms that can actually quite easily manage it if you need to take the child off and need to keep the stroller so the nano mountain buggy nano is from New Zealand it's a New Zealand brand if you want to take it out to use it's also very easy okay all you need to do is to um, unvelcro this okay we saw the hook just now okay All I need to do is to undo the hook. I hope you guys can see. Okay. And I hold the handle and click it. And there you have it. It's got a five point buckle as well. And for baby, where can you use it? You can actually use it from when the child has, is able to somewhat sit. If you don't mind, uh, excuse me. Okay. So this. We can actually lower as well to allow a child to lie down, okay? And for younger babies, infant, you if you have a travel system, the baby carrier that you put in the, as a car seat in the car, you can actually strap it down. The mountain buggy nano already comes with buckles to buckle down the seat and you can use it with newborns, of course, okay? It's also got a shape like this that you can pull out to shield the baby for in terms when there's light rain or you just want to them to avoid the elements like the sun okay this will be the the simple ones at the moment is on sale from uh, at 355 normal price is 455 dollars so if you want to grab it down until the first of november it's going for only 350 only 355 yeah grab them now before it's gone okay various colors while stocks last we have the nano duo sorry it's 335 it's hundred dollars off okay that's for the 
mountain buggy nano. This is the duo stroller, side by side twin stroller. A lot of people find that it's very difficult to get out of the house if you have two kids that are like maybe quite close in age, two to three years, or one year apart, which I had, and sometimes they get a bit too heavy and you don't want to carry them anymore. This is a very good choice because not only is it very easy to maneuver, okay, you'll find that twin strollers always have the problem. If you go into a lift, you find that it's difficult to fit through the lift. This is actually narrow enough, of course, not for use on escalators. Yeah, I never advocate that you use any strollers on uh, escalators. I, for one, always fumble when I have uh, a single stroller on the escalator. For safety reasons, you should always use the lift. And this is very good in a sense that we can actually push it into the lift itself. Okay, double stroller, three stroller, you call it. So each side of the stroller takes up to 15 kilograms. Normally, the recommendation is not to have one too heavy and one too light, but about the same is good enough so that it keeps it balanced. But then for the mountain buggy itself, it's, for, it's the same as the single one. It's also very easy to maneuver. So even with the two kids in, you'll find that it's not so difficult for a mom to push because sometimes with heavy weights up, you might find that some shoulders, if they tend to strain and you find it very hard to actually push it, push it around. It's also very easy to keep, same as the mountain buggy nano, the single one. And basically, like this, how to keep, it has very similar features. It's also pressing it down, yeah, and then... Okay, press it down. There's also a catch at the side. Okay, and a velcro. So it will look something like this when you fold it up. Again, I'm holding with one arm and I'm not a very strong woman. And you can see that I can hold it up by myself. It's nine kilograms when folded up. I forgot to mention that the Mountain Buggy Nano itself comes with a bag and it's cabin size. So I know now a lot of people are not traveling, but if you do need to travel later on, it's actually quite easy. You can just bring the stroller. And it, did I forget to mention also that the Mountain Buggy offers you up to three years warranty if you register on their website, okay? So I'm just going to show you quickly how to open up. It's a cinch. Okay. See, very easy. Doesn't take me a lot of time to set it up. Okay. It's also got the same sun shape. Okay, five point buckles. For the nano duo, if you want to use for a newborn, you will have to buy the adapters and the grab bars are actually sold separately for people who prefer to have grab bars. And also the size for both the single as well as the double, you will realize that the seat can be folded down. Oh, it's black color, so I'm not sure whether you can see it. I'll lift it up. I think I can see it. Okay, that's all for the nano strollers, mountain buggy nano strollers, the double as well as the single. If you have any questions, please ask us. Uh, comment on our Facebook or DM us on IG. They are on sale right now. I think the Nano Duo is on 10% off until 1st of November. For the single one, it will be normal price four three five, and it's hundred order dollars off. It's now going for only three three five until 1st of November on our Gladi Hill sale. So I'm done with the mountain buggy strollers. Now, uh, so how do you keep your stroller and your child safe? When you're out in the elements, it's raining. This weather very unpredictable, right? So if it's raining, then you're going out with the child and you've got a stroller, what do you do? Okay, let me invite next on our show, our product showcase, Charlie, to share with you a little bit more about what are the things, accessories that you can get to actually protect your child who's in the stroller, okay? Over to you, Charlene. Thank you. Thank you. I need this. I need the stroller. 
try this one. Okay, the single stroller. All right, so as you know, most days now, uh, this past few weeks has been raining on and off, right? So if you're out, unfortunately, it rains. Okay, there's, we do have stroller covers. So we actually have different kinds. Okay, this is one thing I'm just showing you and put it on it first. So this is the rear, I don't know whether you can see. <laughs> okay, so this is the rear Peva um, so, uh, solar rain cover. We do have other items as well. Okay, as you can see, the Peva rain cover, right? There is a air vent here. I don't know whether you can see. Okay. And then on the front, you can actually unvelcro. Okay, remove the velcro and you can open up so you can actually see your kids clearly. Okay, why is this so? Okay, if you're covering plastic on top of anything, um, especially when we're breathing, right, it actually pumps up. So having the air vent prevents the stroller cover from actually fogging up you know, and then, okay, this is actually, yeah, I can't go with the kids. Okay? Yeah. All right. So, this is the Peva one, which is all plastic on the side, as you can see. We do have the a bit more designer one. Okay? The sides are made of, um, I'm not sure what calls this one, Peva one. But it's actually black, so the plastic is just in front. It, uh, it's still the same. It has a uh, the flat one on top. Oh, okay. So and there is a reflective strip on the side, so when it's nighttime, you actually can see the stroller, right? Okay. So the Peva one is twenty one ninety now, before discount. And the uh, designer type one is thirty two ninety. This is all before discount. So currently, rear stroller covers are on ten percent off. Okay. We also do have the tandem, uh, or what we call the tandem ones. Okay. We have the side by side twin stroller one, and the tandem one, which is the front and back one. Okay. So different types of twin strollers. You have to have, take different types of um, rain cover. Okay, for the side-by-side -side one, it's 21, okay, both is 21.90 before discount. Same thing, it has air vents on the side. Okay, but for the front, okay, for the tandem one, there is this flap in front. But for this one, that is the side-by-side -side one, it doesn't have, only they have, uh, the air vent on the side. I don't know where you can see on the photo. There, yeah, you can check out the website for more information about this. So, okay, let me run through another one, which is this. Okay, for those who have smaller babies, of course, your strollers are not this type of strollers, you would have those pram types. We also do have the pram type stroller one, uh, rain cover, which is um, okay, this type. Okay, one is the slightly designer one, which is all black, and the other one, okay, with the plastic in front, right? Okay, and then the other one is all plastic one. Okay, all plastic, all the all travel one is actually nineteen ninety. Yeah. Okay, and then the other one's twenty one, uh, twenty nine ninety, all before discount. Okay, so if you want to check out more and get more information, you can see the pictures clearly. You can check out our website, uh, Baby Slings and Carrier or uh, Baby Gates and Safety. Okay, we also do have the, this is the baby carrier, not the carrier we wear one on. Huh? Okay, this, we also have a rain cover for it. 
So actually the handle is quite special because you can, there's a hole there so you can actually still grab on hold onto the handles. Okay, this is $11.90 before discount. So do check out our website, please. Uh, and those who have just joined us, please help us like and share. We'll be showcasing quite a few more products later on. Okay. Okay, so now we're on to the Barang Barang. Okay. Barang Barang, she's dressed up today for the show. <laughs> she's very well dressed, so pretty today. Every day she's pretty, la. she's especially today. No, la, today, okay, because of the rain, la, very hard to pull on the rain. Okay, I, I think you all know that. Rocking grade. Then some more, huh? <laughs> the hanging of laundry. Anyway, okay, so mommies are like me. I like to put barang barang on my shoulder. Okay, especially when we go shopping or grocery shopping. Okay, so I have here the click and go hook, which we actually hang on to the handles. I think you all know that, but this one is slightly clever in a way because the handle uh, sorry the hooks it does it's not the open type one so you have to press it in to uh put in your whatever hanging thing in there and it won't just come off okay oh. now this is better nicer and somewhere this is actually uh velcroed onto the handles okay this is one the other one, more sturdier, of course, the more barang barang you get. Okay? This is the carabiner. Okay? This is big. So you just hook it on, hang on whatever items you actually want to hang on. Okay? All these are on our website, so please do check it out. Oh. go the clip and hook. Um, okay, for the carabiner, is $13.90 before discount. Okay, so beer items are most of them are on 10% off on our website. So please do check them out for a clearer picture. Okay, because I think our lighting a bit too bright already. Okay, while well, my colleague is checking. Okay, original price? Original price Okay, original price is eleven ninety. Okay, this is very good quality one. I would rather get this one, huh? Because it's really sturdy one. As you all know, rear products are German made, so they are actually German brand. I'm uh, sorry, German brand. <laughs> okay, so they are actually quite safety conscious. So all the products are very of very good quality one. Okay, so next, who else likes to put parang parang on their things, right? Okay, these are some of the stroller bags that we have. Okay, I know most of you will typically get the halfway one, right? Okay, this is quite bigger, so it actually hangs on to all the way about here, if you can see, right? Okay, we have something that doubles as a bed as well. So you can just hang it on here. You need to go toilet, diapers inside, just take out the bed. Okay? Keep the stroller part outside the toilet or what, okay? And just take the baby stuff, do the snappy change, or you want to have a quick errand in the bank or whatever. Okay, so this is something very easy to put on to the stroller as well as carry around. It is very lightweight. So imagine you got a lot of barang barang, uh, then the bag is heavy. Uh. Sober break one, sure, 100%. Okay, so this one is about fifteen ninety before discount. Okay, 10% off as well, right? We also, this is the, another type of, um, okay. okay, this is another type of a stroller bag, and the, okay, this is also a, how to say, like sort of a drawstring bag. Yeah, yeah. it's a, a drawstring bag. bag. Yeah, so it's um, printed, okay, the other one was black. This one's printed. Okay, so you can actually, the same thing, you just hang it on and then put your nappy, baby snappies there or whatever. And then if you need to do a quick change for the baby, just pick up the whole thing and go. And go. Right? So and you can carry. It's very stuff. light. And the thing is, it's very lightweight. So imagine having to put heavy things inside. The weight of the bag doesn't add on to the items inside. 
So, okay. So, this is $26.90 before discount. All right? You can check them out again on our website, Baby Gates and Safety. Okay? Rear items are on 10% off. Most of them are on 10% off. Okay? So, this is another type of a stroller bag. I don't know if you can see. Okay. But this is the net pipe one. If you can see from... Okay? It's black, but... Uh, Yeah, it's like this. You can see. Okay. But there is still a lining inside. All right. Okay, this type is the same, but this is not a drawstring one. It's actually a hand type hand carry one. Okay, the first one was shoulder. The second one was you can do a backpack. All right. And then this is this the third one is actually the hand one. So you can just hang it on here. Then need to do as a Earlier on, I explained, you can just take it out and hand carry things, okay? This is similar to those grocery shopping bags that we can actually use as well. And then easy to hang on to the stroller, especially when bringing strollers around, okay? So now for the stroller, okay, for pram types of stroller, Okay, we have what we call a sun sail. Okay, this sun sail one, all right, is just basically, I think it's clipped on if I'm not. So it, it's just poked around and basically you there's a, a string that goes here that you tie onto the handles, all right? Yeah, sliding system. And uh, the other side you will, it's like an elastic that you go under the stroller. And after that, when you when there's sun, you pull it out like this. And then when there's no more, I hope you can see it's sun sale. It's very cheap, only $9.90 before discount. And you can see here, uh, where's the camera? You can see here. So there's string here, but then when there's no more sun, you can actually look at baby by sliding it up, like what Charlene has said yeah. earlier. So it's a sliding system, easy to put on, easy to take off. Folds up very flat and, and small, yeah. easy to clean. Most of the stroller items that you see that I'm showcasing now are all very small pieces once you fold it nicely. It's so okay. small, yeah? Okay, and th okay, this includes a box already, it's small enough. So what more if take out the box? Okay, so the next one I'm showing is actually our stroller umbrella. A lot, yeah, a lot of our customers actually like this one. Okay, cute, right? Okay, because not, okay, the thing is not a lot of the strollers will have this type of shade, uh, shades. Okay, a lot of the, the strollers nowadays, they cover only until here. So most parents, they actually want to cover the, the baby from the sun or maybe because they're sleeping or what. They put it actually slightly. Okay, let me, okay, yeah. So this one we can put it on directly. Okay. Sorry, we're talking cubic on this. I couldn't keep it on earlier. <laughs> so, okay. so okay. So it's basically very simple. It comes like this. You can see the umbrella can be clipped in and taken out quite easily. Just press one button. You can take off the umbrella. So you only do with the handle here. So you just choose a side uh, where it's easy to, usually it depends on where you want to put it. I mean, it's a, it's a personal preference kind of thing, right? So choose a side, tighten it. There is a crank here that allows you to tighten it. So you use a crank to tighten. So once it's tightened already, so this thing, there is some rubber here that allows you to position it nicely. So once it's done, you realize I can just easily hook on. And the umbrella actually has two places where you can actually adjust the orientation of the, the umbrella. One is this big one here. You can see, you can bend here. There's one smaller one here right at the top. I don't know whether you can see, but I can actually do this. So basically, once I do this, depending on where the sun is, so basically, you know, if say, the sun happens to be on this side, I may want to place a bit more on here. So basically, it will be blocking sun coming from here. But if, say, the sun starts to move, I can twist it on the other side. You know, so it allows you to actually do a little bit more. And on top of it, 
the sharp points of an umbrella are all rounded off. These are all little balls, if you can see. So this is convenient. I can actually take out. I can show you the little balls. You can see the little balls here. Here. So okay. So this is the umbrella. So and when you don't need it and you want to keep your stroller, very easy. Take it out. You can probably just fold your stroller like normal and keep the umbrella somewhere else. So this makes it very easy for you to maneuver. In case you don't, uh, later I think Charlie will gonna show you the cup uh, holder. The cup holder actually uses the same holder. So if you position the stroller, uh, your holder at the right place, you can put in the cup holder anytime. All right, so as Donnie explained, right? Okay, this, the umbrella is really quite cute and it's really very, uh, user friendly. I think I'll even use it even with this this thing I, because if I had fire. known that there was something like that, I would have bought it earlier on rather than keep on pulling the whole thing, you know, the whole sunshade until the whole thing is spoiled already. Also, <laughs> okay. So actually, the umbrella is very nice. It comes in three colors, right? So you can just come down. Four colors. Oh, sorry, four colors. Black. Uh, I know navy, there's black, navy, and sand, then, and silver. Uh, sand and silver. Okay, so okay, this is the size of the original box, unopened one. So it's about twenty six ninety before discount. Actually, it's very cheap even before right. even before uh, you take into consideration the discount. Why? Because a lot of times, you know, certain when when you say you have one brand of stroller, they will sell you the same brand of the umbrella and usually they cost like 70 80 or 90 dollars am i right to say that because yes. we call yeah. it branded but uh the real so ones matching matching type one yeah the real ones are a steel normal price is 26 okay and it's universal which means on any stroller okay so i believe okay now donnie has already installed <laughs> so if you have it in holder. the right place you can actually put the cup holder in but of course, you have to position it nicely so that it can be used for the stroller as well as the cup holder. So, but it's the same adapter. So you can see, you can just go into the same slot. But now, of course, it's a bit slanted because of the position where I placed it. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. So which means that this one, we can actually move it up to where we are comfortable putting it on. Okay, if you see, and let me carry this over. Right, so actually Donnie installed it here. So you can actually put it up somewhere or even onto the handle if you want. Make it easier and comfortable for you to reach, right? Okay, so. Okay, so, okay, for those parents who like to walk around at night, especially at night, you know, I want to, you know, relax a bit, walk around the neighborhood. Okay, this is something I would recommend. Okay, this is the Simi LED security light, which you actually hang on to the side of the stroller. Okay, why? is because sometimes certain areas, especially here in Singapore, some have dark places, right? And some actually got a lot or too much light. So those dark places, this actually works very well. So people can actually see that there is a stroller there. There is a baby there. All right, especially when you're crossing the street or you know through a dark jogging path okay this is something i really would recommend you all get just not just for you know safety and uh protection of your baby all right okay sorry the price is 8.90 before discount all right so it's around 10 percent off Right. The last one I'm going to show. Okay, I believe most of us know what this is. Right. This is the clip and glow, uh, glow clutch. Right. As you all know, those um, happy changer one. So it's a changing bag. Okay. So you just fold it in. It's a typical one. Then you, there's actually slots inside. So you can actually put um, diaper creams, powder. 
uh, diapers, baby wipes. Okay. Okay. Give me as a minute, ah. So sorry. Hi guys. Instagram. Okay, we're trying to connect to our Instagram. Okay. All right. Okay. So. Okay, as I was saying. All right. This is clip. Uh, sorry. Clip and go clutch. All right. So this is quite pretty design as well. Simple. Gray, black. You know, it looks like a leaf actually. Right, so you can actually just put on all your baby nappy changes things and then just fold it back. And then this one comes with a strap, so you can just basically hang it on to, as I explained earlier, you got the clip and hook, you just hook it there. Okay, easy to go. And this is for rush nappy changes, easy. And then when you're going for picnics and all. So this is something we can use. Okay, this is $36.90 before discount. So this is a 10% off. Okay. So if any questions, you guys, please do PM us or DM us on Instagram, PM us on Facebook, or comment during the live so we can actually try to answer some of your questions. Okay, if not, I will move over the session now to Donnie will be talking about car traveling, okay? For those who got cars and um, has a new work, maybe some of the things that we can actually recommend uh, for you to put inside the car to actually keep baby safe, keep you safe as well, all right? I'll pass you on over to Donnie. Hello. Okay, wait, ah. okay, let me, sorry, ah, let me remove the solar. Hi, good to see you again. I think uh, a lot of Singaporeans love their cars and then when you have a baby, uh, there's actually a lot of things you can buy for your car for your baby. Um, of course, for babies, you probably start with a car seat and, uh, and in order to support the car seat, there will be some accessories, some baby stuff. Of course, you're going to have some toys if you get more comfortable for the child. Um, there are a lot of products that we have that is that will help you there. And um, but before that, actually, we actually have something which is really interesting for those that uh, are pregnant, lady drivers actually. So we do have a we do have some things which are suitable for the lady driver. This is actually a for people who are pregnant, but you still prefer to drive uh, your own car. So a traditional seat belt actually potentially puts pressure over your tummy. So in case in the event of an accident, there is a very high risk of actually compression on your on your baby's back when that happens. So we do have a special pregnancy seat belt here. As you can see, you can find it on our website, more details on that. Uh, pregnancy seat belt, and this actually helps to make sure that in an event of an accident, even if you're driving, this will keep you safe. So this not just works for the driver. So if you sit in your own car for uh, very often when you're pregnant, it would actually be a very good accessory for you to have to actually lower the risk uh, to your baby in case of an accident. So this is actually a pregnancy seat belt add-on. Something very easy to put on and to keep yourself safe and the baby safe. Huh? Something to consider. And in case you want to make sure that other people know that you are pregnant and you're driving and to uh, and not be too harsh on the lady driver, this is a sign that you can have, you know, once in a lifetime maybe. Once the baby comes, you can have the other one, which is the baby on board, on tour sign. You know, a little bit more more European look. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna have is actually the car seat in your car. So for car owners, I think there's a few things that come to mind because 
if you're going to have the car seat on the your leather, you know, your premium leather car, car is likely going to cause some problems. Where's the... Sorry? Wait, we're just going to grab it from the shelves. Oh, you know what Donnie has gone to do? He's got to look out for more products, but unfortunately, yeah, those we, are have, we, have, we have some uh, that covers more of the seed and all that that actually is out of stock at the moment. So never mind, they should be coming in in the next uh, one, two months. So you look out for them. But we do have a simpler one here, which basically provides uh, protection for your car seat against your baby seat. So you put it on your car seat and then you'll put your baby seat on top of it. That will prevent scratches on your leather. And the other thing is that, you know, when start, baby starts to get a bit older, they tend to, like, you know, feed, eat a little bit. That also keeps your car a little bit cleaner. What I like about this is that they have some storage compartments too. So after you put it in, there will be some storage compartment at the side that allows you to put the convenient things like your bottle, some toys, and some, you know, even diapers, you know, that uh, you can store in your car just in case for an emergency. So... One thing you realize is that once you have a baby in the car, you need a lot more storage than your car can provide. So the next thing you want to think about is where do you logically want to add a little bit more storage in your car without creating a mess. We do have a lot of products that help you with that. Okay, there are the simple ones. Simple ones like this. You can see the simple ones that hang behind your uh, your front passenger seat or your front driver seat. Uh, that gives you quite a bit of compartments at the back. Uh, these are the more cartoony ones. We have this heavily on discount. You can check them out. There's some netting pockets and all. So this allows you to keep all the stuff that you need. Basically, your kids' toys, pencils, crayons, paper, whatsoever. And if you like, you don't like the cartoony look, we have a more professional look one here. This one, gray, gray and black, very nice and classy. So you match most of your continental cars and very nice cars. So this one, and for those that prefers to have the child more entertained, this is the travel kit entertain. Similar concept, you hang it behind your, your front seat and it has actually a very nice pocket that allows you to put in a tablet. And it is also touch sensitive, meaning that you can still use your tablet once it is inside the pocket. So that pretty much creates an entertainment system in your car. You know, maybe you can start a karaoke behind you. You know, I don't know. So something like this gives you new ideas. But more important, more storage means that your car actually can be neater and yet you cater to the needs of your child. So check out our website, then we do have a lot of these storage solutions for your cars, which is going to help you keep your cars uh, neater and safer. And the next thing is that a lot of people worry about when babies in a car, when driving, you know, it's... 4 or, 5, 8, 4 or 5 p.m. in the afternoon, the sun starts coming in from the side, you know, sometimes from the right side, sometimes from the left side. What if it hits my baby? The baby's eyes are very susceptible to, to UV rays and, you know, maybe too, too glaring, they're sleeping. There's a lot of concerns and if you're a driver, you get very stressed. So how do you make sure that baby is taken care of? That is where we start to look for sun shades. We have a lot of sun shade solutions here as well. The more traditional ones are the ones that are using a suction cup, just a netting that folds nicely. It basically folds into something very small. You can keep it into the pockets that you create using the other products. And once you need it, you take it out. It's a suction pad. You stick it on the window and it blocks the sun. So basically, to prevent the sun from hitting your baby too much. 
There are different sizes. Some are rounder. Some are, you know, to fit the different type of cars. We do have also other types. If you prefer those that, you know, I, I don't like to keep folding every time I need. There is actually also a roller blind. Roller blind types are interesting because you just install it. It allows you to use it pretty much like an ETA roller blind. You, know? you just pull, it stays there. And there is a little button you can press at the side, it rolls back in. So something that you can pull down when you need. So something like this could be really, really useful for those people who don't like to have something lying around. They just want to install it and get it done. Hmm? Yes. So do the Sunset fits all cars? Will it block vision if someone inside the car wants to look out? Oh, no. All the Sunshades allowed is generic. So basically, they are universal. You can fit onto any cars. Of course, do check the dimensions of the, the Sunshades on the website before you purchase. It will fit most cars unless your car has particularly small or big windows. Okay? So and um, it does not block vision looking in or looking out from Outside in maybe a little bit more than out, inside out. So you do not expect people inside the passenger to have their views blocked. Okay. We have interestingly some other types as well, which may be a little bit different. This one is actually a. If you can move to that, it? Okay, they are doing some adjustments to the light. Because just now, we need it a little bit lower. Now we can bring it up a little bit higher. That's okay. So basically, this one, most of the other sun shades, we basically will stick them on the inside of the car. Um, but there are some which we have, we have here, which are used a little bit like those that you see on the, the buses, you know, the public buses. They have all the advertisements that are, uh, in a way, stick on the outside of the bus. Um, it, it looks nicer. It looks very nice. And uh, it blocks most of the view go looking into the bus. But it does not, it allows the people inside the bus to still see pretty well. So this is the type that you stick outside, meaning that you stick outside on the window. You still want, you can still wind down your window and all. It still works perfectly fine. Uh, works like a sticker, you stick on, and when you don't need it, you can just easily remove it. So something like this um, will be there. And some people may prefer to do something like this, okay? There are some new ones that we have here. This is a fairly new product. For those that finds that they struggle with the suction cups and all that, and then they, they start to lose their suction cups after a while. Uh, this could be something to solve that problem. This is a new product. What it does is that, you know, it looks pretty similar to the ones that you traditionally have. A bit more colorful, but what makes it so different is this. No suction cups. Basically, it has a more advanced technology here. All you have to do is make sure the glass is clean. And it sticks there. You know, you can probably still see in the mirror somewhere. It just sticks there. I don't know whether you can see, it's just stuck on the mirror behind me. So something like this could be quite convenient and we don't need it, you just take it out. That's it. They come in a little bag here, so allows you to just keep it away. Like this. Oh, I like the heart actually. <laughs> okay, now we have covered the sun shades, pretty much. We have actually the other thing is that a lot of people will start to uh, think, particularly drivers, is that no, uh, when baby is small, your car seat is going to be facing backwards. That would be a safer position for the child. It has been proven in the lab, it's been proving practically that it will be safer for the child.
to keep the is there a question how, how much are the new sunshades you mean this one yes how much are the new sunshades these are 2190 before discount for two pieces so you get 10 percent discount on this huh? then the next thing we look at are mirrors as a driver we want to make sure we are focused on the roads but we also want to have the option to actually check out on the baby once in a while so if the baby is facing backwards we need some mirrors to actually help us take a look at the baby you cannot keep turning your head and see how the baby is doing it is not exactly very very practical so what we usually suggest is that you can use something like this it's a combination of mirrors what you do is that you have a normal size normal small mirror of course you can try to use your real view mirror to see whether it works uh, to look at the baby Rear view mirror usually we will focus more on the rear view windscreen so uh, we may or may not be able to look at the baby more clearly so what we do is when the car seat is facing in front or facing the back is to first have a mirror behind so this is actually a convex mirror something that you tie onto the imagine that the baby is facing this way you will tie this onto the head rest of your rear seat position it nicely so that actually from the front you can actually see the baby and instead of turning your head to look at this mirror you can have another mirror in front of you to position so that you can actually see that so with use of two mirror you can actually monitor your baby's progress so this is a very simple one something like this is how much is this one this is only this is 1890 something very simple uh very practical convex so you can actually see a very wide view we do if you prefer a bigger one some people say you know it's a bit too small for me i want to prefer something bigger we have something bigger here this one is looks a little bit almost like a short uh, <laughs> security mirror so for those that you know uh, you have bigger cars or you prefer that you can see more of your baby or baby can actually see you more um this one is less convex so it's you know some people don't like it being distorted too much so they would prefer a bigger mirror so if you can do that this one attaches to the metal bar of your it attaches to the metal bar of your headrest on the rear seat and allows you to swivel this you can see you can actually control this pretty well so you can exactly focus this on your baby so that the baby can actually see you really really well and you can see your baby really really well from behind so something like this you can actually position exactly where you want so if you prefer a bigger mirror this will actually be very very good so this one how much that one is 34 this is 34.90 before discount so if you prefer a bigger one this is a really really good quality one i forgot to mention all these mirrors are shutter free meaning that in case of an accident or anything you do not expect like glass shards to be flying and all that they be dangerous for the baby no these are all safe okay collision safe <laughs> Ah, this is our latest arrival. In case you don't see it, this is what they call a baby view LED. It's actually something new. So um, it is in answer to some some parents will say that you know you know I have my mirror behind, I have what, but it's at night. My baby is in the dark. You know, and it you know i don't know whether some of some parents have this experience that you are driving alone in the car with your baby behind it's getting dark maybe screaming away you know they can't see you you can't see them you try to on the light but it doesn't help a lot so something like this can be a lifesaver because imagine this you tie it to your headrest 
This one also comes with a very nice swivel control that you have with the big mirror just now. And once you position the baby and you realize that it's getting dark, what you can do is that you can actually press the button and you can on the LED lights that are at the side. So you can see I'm holding here a remote control. So the remote control allows me to on and off the light. Pretty cool, eh? Of course, now I have a big ring light here, so it's, it's, it's not so obvious. But if it's in the dark, this is going to give a very nice, gentle glow on the top. Okay? Just press. Ah, see, you turn, turn the light off, you can see, off, on, off, on. Pretty cool. So you just have to click this remote control, maybe near your near the driver's seat, maybe on top. Something like this. It allows you to easily control. Big button, so you won't miss this. Okay? Okay, so this is something new. How much is this one? This one is $49.90. This is only $49.90 before discount. So if you like to get this one, best to get it during these two weeks. Why? You get 10% off this just two weeks. This is just this is a new arrival, huh? Okay. Okay, I've covered almost all the car accessories except one. This one. Which one? Well, there are some add-ons you can have, like the car signs, um, so that the other drivers on the road actually know that baby's in a car and they would they will be less uh, aggressive against you. So. Um, Huh? is to prevent accidents. Huh? So this one is the baby on tour. And this one, this is more meant for sticking from the inside of the car. We do have something because these days a lot of the cars actually have very dark tint on, on your on your mirror, on your windows. So if you have very dark tint and you put something like this, you're unlikely going to see a lot. So if you feel that your tint is a bit too dark and you want people to still see your baby on, on, on board sign, this is an alternative which allows you to stick on the outside, meaning that you stick on the outside and it's reflective. So if you stick on the outside, it's reflective. From far, people can see that you actually have a baby on board, but you keep you safer. So something like this, good option for those with the dark tint. Huh? And a little add-on for the babies that are water-fed. You may want to like you know warm your milk sometimes, and you're out. You don't have an electric socket. You don't have your hot water with you. This is actually a very very nice accessory over here. It plugs into your usual cigarette uh, lighter, the lighter area, and all you have to do is just place your bottle inside here, and it will warm your milk for you. So, lifesaver, in case you are out of hot water, you're outside, and you have your car. So, plug it in, warm the milk while daddy's driving, and then after a while, you can actually feed the baby warm milk. So, something like this, very handy. This is only how much? This is only 33 dollars This is only $33.90 before discount. So, you have 10% discount over this. Helps you warm your milk whenever you need. Okay, that's all that I have for the car accessories. If you want to look at the full range again, the details, the dimensions and all, please go on to the website, um, go under the product category for cars, and you will see all the products that we have that's related to cars. So thank you very much, Donnie, for showing us the uh, car traveling with the uh, baby session. I almost said that it's car traveling with Donnie. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and uh, for uh, thank you for joining us again today for product showcase. Uh, uh, we On next Monday is our next session. Uh, do we have a question, Cecilia? Sorry, Cecilia. Yes, you missed the sunglasses, but don't worry. They are on 10% off. You can actually watch. We'll keep it on our 
um, our Facebook and it's available on baby slings and carriers and baby gate and safety. At the beginning of the session, we actually showcase the sun, uh, baby eaters sunglasses. They are on 10% off until uh, 1st of November. Okay, so thank you again for joining us on the show for the product showcase today. And we are having the gratitude sale from now. Uh, actually, we are left one week until 1st of November. And every day we've been running product showcases except for Mondays, Wednesdays, and Sundays. Wednesdays and Sundays, we give our voice a break, okay, all of us. Okay. And uh, so what happened is that, oh, thank you, Cecilia, for joining us. Yeah, maybe you can play catch up later. But if you want to have a look at the product showcases that are uh, done previously in the last couple of days, you can always play catch up if it's easier for you. Just go to our website, Baby Slings and Carriers and Baby Gates and Safety. These two websites, you should be able to see a banner on the home page, you click on it, you should be able to see a lineup of events during these two weeks. And we actually have put it up on YouTube. So there is a link that brings you there. If you would like to see spe specific product showcases, it should be there for a while. Uh, I'm not sure if we are going to take it down later on because it, yeah, I don't know what's going to happen, but it's going to be there for now for a while. And uh, Mondays, next Monday, just a quick advertisement this month, okay? For Monday, we are not doing a product showcase. You will join uh, myself, Colleen, as well as my colleague, Michelle, uh, on Monday at 11 a.m. if you'd like to join us for the, what's that called? Uh, auction, okay? It's very interesting, auction style. We have on auction a lot of um, gently used carriers at special prices starting from as low as only $5. And believe me, uh, a lot of them are really new. Some are showroom pieces, but uh, some are uh, thanks to donations from people who are uh, going to help us in this uh, fundraiser for Safe Place. So if you have not uh, heard of Safe Place, we will be inviting them. They are a temporary shelter. In fact, in Singapore, the only ones, a temporary shelter for women with unsupported pregnancies. So uh, they've been, uh, we, we have gone and helped them a couple of times with workshops and we'd like to help them further. So join us next Monday, 11 a.m. on Facebook. Uh, I don't think we're going to play that on IG because it's going to be very difficult for us to control. It's going to be on Baby Slings and Carriers. Facebook, are we going to do it on Baby Gates and Safety? No, just Baby Slings and Carriers, okay? You can get slings, wraps or carriers from as low as $5 starting B and we know there's going to be a lag time so we are going to give a couple of minutes before we close the deal for every single carrier. Just to have a sneak peek, we are going to have some wrap conversion carriers, stretch wrap, some ring slings, a lot of carriers, some tula, okay. But uh, if you want them brand new, you can always buy from our website on discount all the way until 1st of November. All of them are on discount, but you're going to see very rare pieces on our show next Monday for the fundraising auction in collaboration with Safe Place. And we're going to have a very special invited guest from Safe Place who will share with you a little bit more about what we can do to help these mothers. We are mothers ourselves, so stay tuned. And see you next Monday. Bye.